Hello there and welcome. In today's video, we're gonna be looking at nouns. So, let's get started. Nouns are words that name a person, place, or any entity. Anything that exists. Ideas, thoughts, emotions, people, all the objects, cars, planets, televisions, phones, and others can be named. Most sentences have multiple nouns. Some sentences have only a single noun. Proper and common nouns. Nouns that name a particular item in a group are called proper nouns. The first letter is capitalized. Example, Michael Jordan. So, Michael Jordan is a person, an athlete. Pepsi Cola. So, Pepsi Cola is a kind of drink. It is a soda. New York City. This is a place. Nouns that refer to a general class of person, place, entity are common nouns. And they are not capitalized. Example, basketball player, soda, city. Count and non-count or mass nouns. This is the classification according to whether a noun can be counted or not. Count nouns are countable. Example, cat. Tree. Dr. Adams. Book. House. Pencil. Must nouns name undifferentiated must, things that are not usually considered countable. Example, water, milk, grass, sand, news, money. Non-count nouns are usually singular and quantified by quantifiers such as much, more, less, some. Example, some sugar, little butter, less water, abstract, concrete, and collective nouns. Abstract nouns name ideas, thoughts, emotions, for example, love, peace, honor. Concrete nouns name physical objects that have a mass. For example, ball, tree, glass. Collective nouns refer to a group of people or entities. Example, herd, family, army, bunch, tribe. The following slide is a practice exercise one. Chose whether the following nouns are common nouns or proper nouns. You have 5 seconds to give your answer before I'm gonna move on to the next item and give you the correct answer. If you think 5 seconds is not enough, you can pause the video. Number 1. Jerry. Common or proper? Answer is... Proper. Number two, Lisa and Joe. Common, proper. Answer is, it's a proper. Number three, trees. Common, proper. Answer is, it's common. Number four, Dr. King. Common, proper. Dr. King is a proper noun. Number five, shoes. Shoes, common 
or proper? Shoes is a common noun. Number six, Labor Day. Common, proper. Answer is proper noun. Number seven, Jumpsuit. Common, proper. Jumpsuit is a common noun. Number eight, The Wall Street Journal. Common, proper. Answer is, it is a proper noun. Number nine, child. Common, proper. Answer is, common. Number ten, Thailand. Common, proper. Answer is, proper. Exercise two. Fill in the blanks with the correct forms of the given nouns for the following exercise. Use each noun only one time. Chair, job, experience, information, hair, luggage, progress, furniture, permission, work. You have 5 seconds to give your answer before I'm gonna move on to the next item and give you the correct answer. If you think 5 seconds is not enough, you can pause the video. Number 1. I don't have much blank. Just two small bags. I don't have much blank. Just two small bags. Answer is... It is a luggage. Number two. They are going to tell you all you want to know. They are going to give you a lot of blank. Answer is, they are going to tell you all you want to know. They are going to give you a lot of information. Number three. There is room for everybody to sit down. There are a lot of blank. Answer is, there is room for everybody to sit down. There are a lot of chairs. Number four. We have no blank. Not even a bed or a table. Answer is, we have no furniture. Not even a bed or a table. Number five. What does Alan look like? He's got a long bird and very short blank. What does Alan look like? He's got a long bird and very short hair. Number six. Carla's English is very bad. She must make blank. Carla's English is very bad. She must make progress. Number seven. George is unemployed. He is looking for a blank. George is unemployed. He is looking for a job. Number eight. If you want to leave work early, you have to ask for blank. If you want to leave work early, you have to ask for permission. Number nine. I don't think Anne will get the job. She hasn't got enough blank. I don't think Anne will get the job. She hasn't got enough answer experience. Number 10. Shakespeare's are wonderful blank. Shakespeare's are wonderful works. So there you go guys. That's the end of this video. 
about nouns. I hope you found this helpful and if you like this video, please do subscribe, like, share, and let me know your thoughts and questions. Love to hear from you. Good luck and thanks for watching.